I'm Mr. Hasfi Shafi'i, a Kelantan Matriculation Lecturer with three others. They are Mr. Zuhaizi, Mr. Shamir and Madam No Azma has developed an interactive app known as iListening AR. AR stands for Augmented Reality. Educators are facing 21st century learners where the old approach does not seem as effective as before. In the 20th century, teachers were respected because of their knowledge. But in the 21st century, a new approach for teachers would be they have to do with what they know, which means to innovate. As it is not easy to gain students' attention, we as a group have agreed to try to use augmented reality in doing listening exercise. A teacher is forever be a lifelong learner. The objective for our team listening module would be to look at the effect of using the AR approach in conducting a listening exercise. The second objective is to evaluate the student acceptance of using their mobile devices. In this sense, using it for the listening activity from the app. These two objectives are hoped to highlight our educators' challenge when they are facing online teaching. Our innovation, newest objective is to evaluate the effectiveness of this listening technique in improving the student listening skills. This will be achieved from our future research in order to see how technology can guide the students. Now we look at the timeline of our innovative project. We started with brainstorming session, listing all the possible challenges and problems in doing listening exercise online. After that, we try to find out what type of solution can counter such learning problem. This is how we come up with our iListening AR product. The next phase is the software development stage, where one of our group members use Unity software to create our app. At the same time, other group members are assigned to develop and improve our listening exercises. After that, we merge the learning apps with our listening exercise. The third phase would be testing the apps in real life because the data from only the hypothesis is limited by applying it in a natural classroom environment we are able to get the student feedback. The comments will be used to improve our innovation product further. Because of the influence of CEFR in language learning, our team is still upgrading the listening material before we will share them with other educators for further improvement to the app. For this section, we will be looking at the benefit of our innovation. Three aspects will gain benefit from this app. They are students, educational fields, and the classroom teaching. First of all, the benefit of that a student will get from this app will be flexibility. They can choose anytime and anywhere to do the listening practice. The app itself is interactive and this will improve their attention and focus. Using live worksheet will enable the student to stop and record their progress and they may continue the question afterwards. The second benefit will be towards the educational field. The AR technology is relatively new in the listening approach, so there are endless possibilities for how a teacher can apply this, familiarize themselves with QR, then AR, and finally to the level of VR. This will be a great challenge for future educators. Lastly, we will look at the benefit that can be influenced classroom teaching. Using this app will make it safer and more organized because a teacher needs to bring less items, only phone and QR cards. No need to worry anymore with electricity socket plug problem in a class. Finding of our Google form and observation where one of our group members observed the class as a non-participant observer and write down his finding in a field note. When asked students about the suitability of using a smartphone in a listening exercise, 100% agree that it is suitable and many of them are aware about AR and VR technology. 
from the listed advantages in using the AR in listening exercise, the three major reasons would be it's easier to check the answers, fun and flexible. Majority agree with to check the answers. For the accumulated five hours of observation, our observer concluded that when students are using the eye listening AR apps, they are much more energetic and will not get tired easily or fall asleep. The drawback is in terms of a phone operating system or OS that might be too old or the internet speed connection. Thank you.